Okay, yesterday we made our raised beds for the uh, new plants that will be transplanted into the high tunnel. Next step will be to install the irrigation and um, uh, plastic mulch to prevent the uh, weed growth. Also in here we've just transferred the plants from the germination room into these portable miniature hothouses and we've we'll see how they do in the high tunnel oops <coughs> kinda heavy that lid we've got two of them and maybe 150 160 tomato plants cucumbers melons all sorts of things the temperature this morning outside was uh, 40 Two degrees inside at 8:30. We're looking at about 76 degrees. So we'll have to monitor the temperature in the high tunnel today as we proceed. At the end rows, which we haven't formed the raised beds on yet, we'll be flaming the um, the vegetation growth here later on to get rid of that prior to the raised bed on the sides and the uh, plastic mulch installation. Okay, the next step with the raised beds is to install the irrigation lines, the drip tape, as they call it, and that will be hooked to main header line and our water supply. Then we install the uh, plastic mulch and the raised beds over the irrigation. And the next step will be to put the actual plants in. We've got a few tomato plants waiting to go in. And a few other cucumbers, tomatoes, and melons, onions, broccoli rob, broccoli, and a lot of others in the uh, germination room yet. Okay, now we've got everything in place, uh, tomatoes planted, uh, row covers complete, stakes in place, and the high tunnel is prepped. Irrigation systems installed, timers are activated upon setting, And most of the plants are in here with the exception of a couple of sweet peppers and jalapenos which were still germinating. These rows that are uncovered um, have um, broccoli, broccoli rob, carrots and herbs over here have yet to germinate. They've been in for two or three days. And there's some peppers, golden wonders here, a slot for the sweet peppers when they're ready, and some cow wonders, and a small slot for some jalapenos which are germinating, and we've got some cayenne in place there. The melons in this row and the cucumbers in the other row. I might have that reversed. Yeah, I do have that reversed. Those are the melons. Cucumbers are here. They won't take row covers. They'll take a uh, no plastic mulch. They'll take a, a living mulch, yard clippings, uh, field cutting of vetch, etc. And down at the other end, uh, We've got a few, a couple rows, double rows of spinach that was planted yesterday. Some sunflowers that were planted just this morning. And the corn which was planted two or three days ago. A little windy out there, huh? Hear that wind with them. We'll keep you posted as we, uh, as the plants uh, start germinating and, and uh, growing.